Welcome to episode 11 of the Molehill Report. It's exactly one year since we started the Molehill Report in January 2022. Throughout the year, we produced 10 episodes with interview guests such as Ricardo Valli, Controlled Weirdness, Peter Votava, Son Culotte and Neil Fist. And topics like the Hecate Sound System, Refocus events, Hakim Bay and the Temporary Autonomous Zone, clubbing and warehouse parties in the 80s and 90s in London and New York, as well as the history of Praxis Records and updates regarding release and developments concerning praxis and data site. Our guest in this episode is Joe Glantz, also known as Sudden Infant. Joe and I met in the late 80s. We started making and releasing music around the same time. Both lived in Berlin, London, back in Switzerland and back in Berlin again, but often at different times. Joe started creating an amazing catalogue of musical works, countless releases on cassette tape, vinyl and CD and extensive tours followed. He's become the subject of a book as well as a feature documentary film. He also contributed to Datasite and contributed a spoken word piece to one of our talk events, which you can also watch on our channel. We sat down with him in January 2023 in Berlin to talk about his journey from punk to noise to actionism over the last three decades. The Schimpfluch label was run by Rudolf himself. Um, and uh, it was obvious that uh, when we became good friends and we worked together that he also wanted to release my own stuff. So um, I released the, first, the very first Sudden Infant LP, Radio Orgasm, on his label. Um, I recorded it at the radio studio in, in Zurich, uh, Laura. Uh, together with guests. The manifesto on the, on the back of the record um, is, uh, as you probably um, can guess, uh, very influenced by the, by the Vienna actionists. It, it means for me like um, uh, to um, uh, kind of a liberation act to step out of, of the um, of the bourgeois, bourgeoisie uh, context and create your own creative universe, yeah, just do what you want to do. Be courageous, be crazy, um, be subversive. I always loved the, the energy of punk, so I wanted to transform this energy also in, into an experimental performance. Um, I mean, you know, I, the early Sudden Infant stuff was mainly very noisy. <laughs> the human voice for me is the purest um, expression. You know, like um, uh, as a, when, when a baby is born, uh, it's not really, I mean, kind of looking around all the time it's mostly making noises like with the voice you know kind of <laughs> this uh, expression you know uh, is, is, is fantastic and uh, you eventually then start to build words and, and, and uh, um, your own like style of expression so that's why I was really keen on working mainly with with my voice um, and I got more into working with words as well, with texts and, and with like poems, uh, but mostly in the, in the sense of, of kind of childish things like nursery rhymes and, and Dadaistic uh, uh, word constructions that I, I really love, like um, things that you repeat all the time and then you change it slightly. So this got a... a a main part of of um, of the my work of the work of Southern Infant, and it still is. Swings, strange things, every hour, sweet and sour, no existence. Dogs can swim, full resistance. Life can kill, autistic fit, hysteric split, stormy moments. My opponents. Watch the whole interview with Joe Glantz on our channel and you'll find out a lot more about his life and work from the early days with his punk band via his extensive solo work and collaborations to the recent metamorphosis of the Sudden Infant Project into a three-piece band. I also dare a 
brief preview of what's coming up on the channel in February. Besides the full version of the interview with Joel Glantz, we'll publish a video of his talk at the Dataside event at Veto Mart in Berlin in 2018 and a video of a live show from 2022. The long overdue long version of the interview with Son Quilot, my talk about revolution and counter-revolution in Germany in 1919 about the murder of Rosa Luxemburg and Karl Liebknecht and the instrumentalization of their memory, first published in Dataside 18. An exclusive DJ mix by Cree from the January edition of Refocus. Three more audio uploads from the back catalogue of Praxis Records releases, as well as a couple of short videos of live performances at Refocus. And, last but not least, of course, the next episode of the Molehill Report. A lot of material is coming up on the channel, so please consider subscribing.